you cannot email a PDF file which is more than 25 MB in Gmail. In case it is more than 25 MB, Google automatically uploads it to Google Drive and actually it shares a link with your uh, email. But you might have your own reasons for which you would not like to upload your file onto Google Drive and you would like to attach your file with the uh, email. So in this video, I'm going to exactly show you how you can compress your PDF file to reduce its size. Alongside that, I'm going to quickly cover that how you can save your Google Docs or Microsoft Word file into PDF, how you can check the PDF file size, how would you compress that file and, and at the end I would show you how to attach a PDF file in email and how to send a PDF in Gmail. So if you've done your work in Microsoft Word uh, and you want to save it as a PDF, you would go to file and then you will click save as, then click this PC, select the folder where you want to save a file and then from here uh, save file type, click PDF and then click save. So you would be able to convert your Word document into PDF just like that. Similarly, in case of a Google Docs, once your document is ready, go to the file and then go to the download and then download it as PDF. Now the next question is that how would you find out that what is the size of your PDF file? For that you need to click on to your PDF file, right click and then click properties and from here you would see the size of the PDF file like in my case it is 12.1 MBs. While there are many websites available online which can help you to reduce the file size uh, of your PDF but the website Website which I want to recommend is from none other than Adobe. Uh, this uh, is an online um, free option available which means that you can uh, reduce the file size of uh, your PDF uh, on your mobile from this method also. And this is also valid for the Mac users because it is an online option. So you can go to this uh, URL adobe.com slash acrobat slash online slash compress dot PDF HTML and you would reach here or you can uh, search uh, uh, compress PDF file from Adobe and for once you reach here you either have to drag and drop your PDF file or you can browse it by clicking this select a file and then go to the folder where your um, PDF file is stored. Upload that file by selecting that file. The uploading is going to take some time and then it is going to automatically reduce the file size and it will give you the compressed PDF file which you can download it. We'll just wait for the file to upload and get compressed. So once that file is uploaded, um, you will get three options uh, in terms of the compression level. High compression is the smallest size but with low quality. Medium is uh, with good quality and low compression uh, is not going to reduce much of a size. So my recommendation is that if you just have a text in your PDF file, go for high compression. But if you have uh, pictures or graphics, um, in your PDF file then go for the medium compression and then click compress. In the meantime just to let you know that the Acrobat online PDF compressor tool can compress a PDF file up to 2 GBs. So once it is done you can download the file and you can check the file size the way exactly I have shown you by right clicking and checking the properties and in case that file size is still larger you can go for a higher compression. So now that you have compressed the file how would you attach the file uh, with your uh, email uh, just like you normally compose an email write the recipient subject matter the text and from here click attach file go to the uh, file which you want to attach click open it is going to take some time and it was it was going to get attached and uh, you just have to press send and your email will be sent to the recipient since i have not added any address so it is not going anywhere if there was any question or a query which i have not covered here you can ask me in the comment section below i'll try to make a quick quick follow-up video in any case if you have liked this video do give it a like and do share it with others thanks for watching